turning now to the reveal of Time's Person of the Year. Every year since back in 1927, the magazine has selected the man, the woman, group, or concept that had the most influence, for better or for worse, during the world during the previous 12 months. And here to share the big reveal, mm -hmm. Time's Editor-in-Chief, Edward Felsenthal. Hi, Edward. Good morning. Hi, Edward. Hi, good well, before to see you. we, well, let's stretch it yeah. out a little bit. Yeah. Is there a big debate right. inside the halls of Time? Always. Yeah. Always. Uh, we start every year in the fall with a big meeting, all of our journalists from all over the world debating and nominating, and then we send out some reporting teams and narrow it down. So is it a straw poll vote? Like, how do you decide who's the, who, we, who do you pick? We have a committee and a lot of uh -huh. discussion, and at the end of the day, we, we come up with one. We poll our readers uh -huh. and people outside of time as well. And here it's not are. like a Powerball lottery ball with <laughs> no, faces? There's no, no Powerball lottery. All right. Well, we'll let you do the honors. Who's Time's Person of the Year? The Person of the Year is Elon Musk. Okay. He is reshaping life on Earth and possibly <laughs> life off Earth as well. And, mm -hmm. and this is someone also who, in becoming the richest person in the history of the world this yeah. year, really speaks to the moment we're in, to this very complex moment in the world. Some people may look at Elon Musk, and he's got foes, too. I mean, he's a rich guy who's done a lot, but there are a lot of detractors. Fans and foes, yeah. leg legions of them. He's, you, you look at Tesla this year, his electric car company became the biggest car company in the world by far. Uh, electric vehicles now really in the mainstream, and that's his doing. SpaceX, his space company, is mm -hmm. the global commercial leader in space. NASA chose it to get astronauts back on the moon for the first time in 50 years. And as I said, we are in this kind of new gilded age where, like it or not, so much of our lives, even in this moment of incredible mm -hmm. inequality, are being shaped by these very wealthy mm -hmm. uh, tech leaders. We have a couple, you have a new category, heroes of the year, who were? The vaccine scientists. Mm. Uh, we, we, as you say, Savannah, it's a new category. This is a unique moment in history. And we just felt, you know, the word heroes is something not to be used lightly. Influence, which is what we talk about a lot at time, is complex. It can be good or ill. These vaccine scientists have uh, done something that is really an unalloyed positive mm -hmm. in the world, changing yeah. the not only the course of the pandemic, we still have to get them distributed mm. through the world, but but also the future of medicine in so many ways. Well, it's so nice to see some of their faces for some of us for the very first time. Absolutely, and, and they, they years and years of work standing on each other's shoulders. Two other quick categories, sure. which we love, Athlete of the Year and Entertainer of the Year, according to Time Magazine, so. We chose Simone Biles yeah, as our great Athlete of the Year, yeah. um, incredible, greatest gymnast of all time, and uh -huh. standing up for mental health at the Tokyo Olympics in such a powerful uh -huh. way. And? Olivia Rodrigo is Entertainer <laughs> of the Year, youngest solo artist us ever to hit the top of the charts and letting us all be in touch with our teenage emotions yeah. <laughs> in a year when we really needed it. Yeah, yeah. cool. Yeah. Times right. Editor Chief Edward Felsenthal, thank you for coming by. Great Thanks. to see you. And we should mention Times 2021 Person of the Year issue is on stands this Friday. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.